I've had several people approach me about call centers the, the last few weeks. You want to set one up and you have no experience. I need clients. If you bring clients, the rest of it can work out. If you've got no clients, then I already own the building, I already own the call center. You need to come with something that we can utilize. It's as simple as that. Money, well, I already have money. Um, the next group is those that actually want to outsource some of their work. Yes, we can do it. We can absorb it in our own call center. I have several of the call centers I work with as well. So if you need virtual assistance, you need um, people that do modem resets and stuff like this, um, we do it all. It's not a closed shop, even, even to the point where we do help desk, remote help desk services for FM companies, etc. We can do all of it. Um, so yeah, if you've got your own business and just want an external arm or you've got a call center US, UK, wherever and want an external one for out of hours, etc. We can do that as well. Um, if you've got a business that has telemarketing, tele, tele, uh, telemarketing, telesales services and want us to do the marketing sales for you, we can also do that. But when they, I need to look at what you're selling. Um, the reason for that is I know which ones will sell and which ones won't. Um, the other side of this being is we also operate in Spain. The advantage in Spain is we have a market that's pretty untapped because a lot of people aren't really pushing the Spanish side. It's not as saturated as the UK and US market um, due to the fact that Filipinos, Indians, Pakistanis, etc. do not speak Spanish. Um, so there's opportunity there as well. So whatever the product is, bring it forward and we can have a look at it from a partnering point of view, from me setting it up for you, from me operating it from you, uh, for you. Just bring your ideas forward. I'm quite, I'm quite open and easy to talk to, um, as long as you're not absorbing my time in large amounts.